<laughs> okay, so th is th this is the start? Yeah, this, yep. yeah, this is this the, is the main. 50 start. Yeah. And I, oh, I got a shuffle crack. Chromie got a bad start. Oh, lands out. Look at that. The salami on the 125 what? got a whole shot. What? What? The... That, what? That 125, though. It must have, like, jumped the gate. <laughs> Probably. But, yeah, the... fanboyism. Oh! Oh it. my god, look at that scrub. I didn't think he was gonna make it. <laughs> And I gotta disagree, Rito. I think Colonel Lynch's spike looks sick. I, I really? Like it. Uh, oh! It looks a little bit childish, but it looks really cool at the it same time. It looks very childish. It reminds me of like a Barbie girl house or something. Oh, and it's a pileup. It's a big pileup. And that's oh, actually man. going to give Colonel Lynch the lead here. Yeah. Oh, you might just check out. He has the speed. Oh, that put Craig Leak in the second, too. Where do we have Seabolt? See if is Craig Leak tries to punt Connor like he did in the heat race. Seventh. So Seabolt is him. actually not that far behind, so Seabolt is in a good spot. And we have Chromie in 16th, so our top three containers pretty much very spread apart. Clement Line. Uh, oh, Leak went down. Whoa, Seabolt went down as well. I'm just oh, Clement Line computer. actually got I'm landed on, all my but just, in. Just goes on. Actually, where has the Patty been this year? Like, does he not play as much anymore, or what? He was pretty much like not existing 2014 either, so I don't uh, think he plays as much. Unfortunately, it, he's always it's still, fast. Yeah, it's still crazy that he can get on the game and be fast. Yeah, I mean he's still got his speed. Kind of like Leclerc. Leclerc took a break. Yeah, what he happened? didn't make them, and he didn't make the main event tonight. And uh, he, uh, yeah. how was your points later? Yeah, yeah. so that's going Dang. to upset the points big time. So deep at his second place, really fun to see him back. Common is just checking out right now, and the salami is like, I believe fifth. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I mean, that's Two so nice. Salami. Tripling into so triple triple. Oh, oh my! Oh. Jump into the back of Lana there. That's going to put Lana on the ground for another few seconds. That's a 4:27 oh. of Derek Forp getting pushed around and Lana getting landed on again. And my homie Chromie, he just came over the finish and I believe he made it quite a few positions right there. Yeah, oh, he's in eighth right now. Yeah, he made a good, really good lap considering all the traffic. He actually got One past Seabull too in all the mess. Oh, and look at that. Well, I know they're in team speak oh. together. What are you doing, Chromie? <laughs> he actually clipped the <laughs> rear end, I think, of the guy in front of him. Seabolt is fifth now. I mean, can you guys play? In, I mean, probably more aimed towards you pros. Do you play with team speak on or off? On. Wait, like, oh. like, okay, like, here's a funny thing about my team speak that I'm always in. Yeah. Uh, whenever we're qualifying, we have a word for like whenever you get halfway through the track and you're on a hot lap, we yeah. say the word bacon and then everybody else like stops talking just because they know you're focusing. Oh yeah, that makes sense because I've, I've always been sort of I had a, like in the 2014 amateur 125 championship, I had two teammates. One actually won the championship and one I don't know what happened to him halfway into, mm. but they always like spotted for each other and I just can't get to work. I get so distracted when I should talk or listen to somebody yeah, talking. Yeah, like uh, Chromie was just spotting me from my LCQ and he's mad at me at the moment because I didn't make it, so. <laughs> 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 Makes sense though. But look at Colonel Lin's lead already up to 12 seconds and we're only on lap 4. Yeah. Um, Chromie's having a hard time getting through the pack actually. Yeah, where's Chrome? Oh, he's back to 8th eight. Eight place on Seabolt. That was actually behind him a moment ago, so up to 4th, so quite a big of a shake-up. Did you guys uh, see Connor's actual fast lap here, his 58.8? No, I don't. Mm. You know. Oh, because he put up a video of it, and literally it's just, like, I feel like I'm going the same speed as him, but he's just so smooth whenever he hits everything. I, d I just so Chrome just jumping into Derek Forp doing the quad into the turn that was so such a risky move I mean it's so hard being smooth I think I just can't I mean especially if you look at my time I could send you the demo if you want it's 
uh, on the last lap. I've made every hot lap on the last lap yet f to qualify. That's. But I mean, on the at the end of the stuff, it's so sketchy. I don't. I just well, can't imagine. I remember watching you at Washugo last year, and oh. I believe you've gotten <laughs> a lot faster since then. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I mean, for sure, I've tried to really work on the consistency to sort of be able to make laps and laps. To, yeah. uh, and also to qualify because 2014 was pretty much the year where I realized I found Vanley setup as well as I realized consistency pays off. So since 2014, oh. I've just skyrocketed compared to my four years before that. Oh, Lens just went down, but he had a 20 second Put lead. Put the pole. Yeah, <laughs> and Deep Paddy actually went down as well. Oh, and Seabolt's uh, yeah, yeah, second. Yeah, Seabolt's up to second now. He's running some good laps as well. And is but that I mean, Clement Lund in front of Seabolt? Yeah, I believe so. No, that's a... Uh, let me go check. I think it is, 32. No, it's Alanis. Yeah, it's Alanis. Oh. No, he actually got... Uh, no. actually both oh, of and Alana. Oh, dang. Yeah, so Lana just They're both there. dropped like a rock in the ocean. Yeah, they're actually 18th and 19th. Not having the best night of their lives, and Alans have had such a big trouble just this qualifying for the main events lately. Um, and Lands went down again before the finish. He only ran a 113 that lap. Oh people's, man. People's caught up a lot, it's only 7 seconds. So much people everywhere. There's <laughs> a lot of people. I wanna see here if, oh, Alana's, oh, oh see no. what's actually getting into him. I've. But that's also the thing, like, you gotta assume if a rider should move or not. That can be so tricky at times, especially in amateurs. Yeah, I, I literally feel sorry for you guys that race that. I mean, I can, I know how to be a lapper, I know how to lap people, but I just can't keep a straight line, that's my main issue. Yeah. That's the problem with amateurs. Well, and that's the problem They too. have the like best they... intentions, but they can't follow through with them. Exactly. Yeah, because like, they feel like, yeah, they're slowing down and getting out of the way, but they're slowing down in the main line. Yeah. And uh, you end up just rear-ending them. Exactly. So, Logan Depot are trying to catch up to Craig League for... fourth? Oh, he Wait. dropped like a rock. Oh, yeah. And oh, oh no. Down. What? Oh, Andy, Patty. What that, that was a big... How high is his fork suspension? Yeah, it's just like he went so deep it into exploded. the It exploded. Yeah, he's actually got off the bike. Who's the... Uh, oh, how do you say his name? Orlean Van de Capel? I don't know how you say Orlean that. Orlean Van de Capel. I mean, this is Europe, so you just do best of pronunciation, because every single... You just know? bullshit your way through it. But yeah, how do you much. know reading that? That's what that says. <laughs> I've read that name since I think last year, so I'm just going with my best shot at yeah, the name. Yeah, what the first thing you have to say, just like, yeah, you just go with it. Yeah, I mean, that's uh, the number one, because you have the French names there, just, I can't pronounce a single word in French. No. You have the Spanish, Italian, German, Dutch, The French are Belgium. also, like, really hard to pronounce, just because the speech is so back in your throat, in a way. Yeah, I mean, See, that's the funny thing. I, I can get the French names because I live in Canada and exactly. French is their second oh, yeah. language. No, that's right. But that's the only the only thing. I very hard for me to pronounce anything else. Hey, I just noticed that Janik's in ninth. Or Yannick, however you say that too. Yannick Muller. Yeah, he's in ninth. And then Will Whiteley, my old teammate's in seventh. Oh, nice. And actually, Lunes went down. Just after the finish line, so he only has about a five second gap at the moment back to Seabolt. They have left. Oh, no one's third, rage quit yet. But they have left third place. Like, they are 27 seconds ahead of Craig Lee. That's amazing. The, yeah. There you go. And we're actually oh. over, almost two thirds into the race here. Lap and time. Seabolt, Seabolt's last lap finally broke underneath the one minute with a 59.4. That's insane. Where's Chromie? He's... He's way back. He was in like ninth, thirteenth like place, thirteenth now. Wow. Yeah, wow. You have the live stream module. Module. Actually, if you wanna uh, have a live timing too, on a second screen or something. Like how Chromie's not even running the military bike. Yeah, he said he didn't like it. I asked him about it. So much more sick. I think I downloaded two or three military bikes. My new bikes are sick. I might not have made it tonight, but I look sick. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it was Green shot material. 
Yeah. Gustavo does oh. some great work for me. Yeah, for sure. Wow, Lin's making it all. Oh. And deeper, they actually. Did he go down? No, his deck oh. is going slalom between all these lappers. It's just a lot of luck <laughs> right now. Well, that, and I, I saw him land in the actual rut that time, and he OJ'd the double. Yeah. X Games was last week. Come on, guys. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. So, thanks, so, Coombs, for hosting me. Um, so who do you believe is going to get the win? Do you think Seabull's going to be able to catch up, or do you think it's going to be Linz? I think Linz is going to get the win. I mean, Seabull's yeah, already cleaning out the RF scene, so... <laughs> well, yeah, yeah in he's got to give some wins to someone. In telling you the truth, though, I think Linz wouldn't mind it. Like, it wouldn't be a big... Like, he wants to win, you know, but in points-wise, Chromie's so far back right now, he would be pretty happy with what he's going to get, I think. Yes, and uh, I don't know where Seabull is, actually. Oh, he's in fourth, so he's 27 points behind, so... Yeah, so it wouldn't hurt him that much. No, yeah. Because he got disqualified for one, didn't he? I, he did. I believe so. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah, he did. Four oh, he's really close now, Oakland. He actually jumped the double into... It was round four, First lap. I think. Actually yep. jumped the double into... And he actually tripled into that resection or whatever. First lap and landed on somebody, so... Well, That's Chromie like right now has finally just gotten the six, and he's right behind fifth, which is Linus Gorenson. So, yeah, this is really nerve-wracking. Oh, and he goes down. I was just waiting for something to happen with the lapper. <laughs> well, look at the battle between Seabull's caught him. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Out. There goes the lead. There are four people in a line. Two of them are lappers. Yeah. Look, there's just. There's no end to the people just in front of them right Throw now. Throw me ban, Linus just said. Something must have happened. Probably punted Linus, considering Linus is down. Yeah, oh, that's... he just rolled the triple. Oh, look at the battle for heating up for first oh, place. Oh, and again. Karma, he's down. Oh, Chromie dead. Oh, and Linz actually uh, passed Seabolt with the lead. Yeah, oh, no. straight up. Yeah. Seabolt actually went off the track. Yeah. And Linz got a better drive through the sand, so Linz just made a pass. And let's remember that. Chromie was banned last year for, I think it was one round, for taking Joachim Norum down last turn before the finish. And uh, if I remember correctly, Norum didn't lose a position, but Chromie actually lost one position in that move. But he still got the championship, so he's fast for sure. Oh, oh. this is a good battle for the win. It's two laps to go. Yeah. Two seconds between them right now. Well, I Actually, I guess you could say three laps, because they just now got on the lap 13. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. True. So let's find Chrome here. He's all the way back to... I mean, Craig Leak is running a really good uh, race here in third, but he's 35 seconds behind. And look at that. Chrome is back to 12th place after being sixth on the last lap before this one. And they're lapping Logan Deepaddy now, which is in... Uh, and he's in sixth. Just insane. Uh, see, here's like another person, back to the AM situation, Stefan Guido, he ran AMs for that, uh, I forget what series it was back in the off season that, that they ran. Um, uh, Farm he, MX? No, it was, a, it was outdoors. Oh, it was uh, an EMS series. Italian Championship? Yes. Yeah. And he ran amateurs, and he's running fourth right now, and he just turned pro. Yeah. But I think he's, I don't think he's played too long, because I don't remember seeing him... 2015, I no, might he, have yeah, forgot. He wasn't, so. Yeah, he wasn't around back then. I, I'm kind of getting pissed off how fast the people these days are getting fast. I mean, the thing uh, is, like, what you can't do really is get mad, because the more you get mad, the worse you do. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, I don't oh. think Connor Lintz has been playing for very long, like a year or no, something. Is he's, oh, Seabolt down. Like Craig Leakes just too far behind to do anything. Wait, Chromie? But w what do you think the reason is that people get so fast these days? Like, back in my oh, day, I, I didn't... The dedication. <laughs> Dedi yeah, you I think have so? a job. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean... Yeah, it's... Chase has a job. I got better shit to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, that's I don't like give me. Like, damn. I'll, I'll make some of the EMF rounds, but like my coast is like about to be over for a little while on uh, RF. And I'm about to leave for like a month and a half long trip. And I believe I'm going to be able to make some of the EMF rounds, but I'm not sure yet. 
Yeah. Mm. Um, but that's true. It's more exposure to the game and more dedication with the big series and stuff. Yeah. I mean, back when I started playing 2010, you, that was the first year of the real replica Supercross, if I'm correct. So it wasn't too much back then. Well, as of right now, I believe we can call this win a W for Connor. I hope I don't jinx him, but... Yeah. He's looking really good, yeah. I don't see him losing 15 seconds in one lap. Oh. oh. <laughs> Lap's five. <laughs> Commentator's curse, right there. He could roll everything, he'd be fine at this point. Yeah. yeah. But I will say, Seabolt has ran a really good race. Yeah, yes. he came from behind. Linz actually was up in the lead, like, and lap one, then... And like, here's another thing, they are 31 seconds ahead of third, and actually third, 24 seconds ahead of fourth. I mean, I can't oh. believe how fast these guys are running. Connor fourth lap. got laps. Yeah. So Connor winning, Seabolt second, and Craig Leake is actually secured a third place. So I want to see here Chromie, where he's at. Chromie is currently at 10th place. Oh, that was man. a good ride for Derek Thorpe, too. I believe this was his first actual EMF race he's done. I don't know. I think I saw him last Bro, week. Bro, we just made two spots in oh, the really? last corner. Yeah, I think I saw Thorpe last week, but I don't think he made it into the main. And is that Deepare? Really? Did Deepare quit? He actually disconnected in the last turn before the finish. A genius. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, that's like what Clay Alfred did. I think it was Anaheim, too. He was second, and then... Goes to ninth in the He's gonna he's gonna go back to fifteenth place because of that. Yeah. Dude, that, top was 10. Like, that was like another thing that was discussed really highly in RF last year was that the people that would like rage quit on like lap three or something, uh people from the concies started getting mad because that was like a position they could have had in the race, you know. Exactly. So, uh, I I believe they look they're looking like they looked more into it last year, but there really wasn't anything they could do about it. Yeah. I'm, I want to get back to that topic. I just want to round down. So Connolly is taking the victory over Jeremy Seabolt and Craig League for third. Stephanie Guido and Derek Forbes. That's the top five. And nice to see Derek Forbes up there. Pretty new to the scene. But yeah, like you said, I mean, it feels like it sucks so much when you finish a race and pretty much half the people have quit. Yeah. yeah. And it's also one other thing, like in Nationals, when people came... Like the last tenth position, thirtieth to fortieth place, people wouldn't show up for Moto Two. That's quite sucky too. Like, thirty-two guys starting out of forty for yeah, Moto Two. Yeah, no, I agree. I agree with you, because like I believe like the because there's nothing better in this game than actually getting to race because you learn a lot more than just putting down laps. You learn how to actually ride with a full gate of riders. Exactly, and it's that experience is hard to get on the stock servers. Sure, you can get 20 riders, but it's the stock servers at the same time. It's not a race pace. People don't try as hard either. Watching the amateurs of amateur class. Yeah, really. very much. This is the warm up for 450 now. Did Stefan Guido actually get lapped in fourth? Mm -hmm. yes. yes. Wow. Oh, wow, I loaded in quite quickly with all my. That's the thing with my new computer, Chase. It can run 125 with all the skins, but it mm -hmm. takes three minutes to load. Yeah, same here. It's because uh, I what I've been told is because of Jay's Cowie. Everybody's running Jay's Cowie. And Jay's Cowie like... and Mason's Honda. That's what the issue is. Yeah. yeah. I wish they would make a little bit more low poly version of the bike, because I mean I can run like two, 1024 pretty much maxed out settings when I play alone. But as soon as I get some specific skins, especially in the 450 class, I have to restart the game. Yeah. From time to time, every single. That's like Team Volcom and Team Impact get one hey, to work. Sal hey, Salami just said Storkin. He actually got, I think he got 16th. Not bad. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the LCQ, that's hard to expect. To, to me, to me, if you score a point, you're good. I, like me, like RF, I've been like. Not doing too hot in the main events, but I'm still making the mains and scoring points, and that's all I care about. Yeah, I mean, I have sort of a motto. As long as I don't get last, I'm pretty happy. Even if it's in amateurs. Yeah. 
So that was probably why it wasn't too good of a lapper last week because I was so far down. I don't want to. I didn't want to be 20th place. That's just sucky for That's me. No fun. Yeah. So let's see here if I need to restart the game to get some frames going. So this team speak we're in is this actually like the actual EMF team speak? Because I've never known about this one. I think it's like the EMC. Yeah, EMC private, slash EMF team speak. I don't. I mean, EMF isn't really a team. It's more me, Nayubi, Bruno, and Maxim. I guess uh -huh. at the moment. So I, f I would say EMC is more fair. Slash French Bridget. people. How here's like I don't want to get involved with Maxime, you know, but how old is Maxime? Uh, around twenty somewhere. Okay, cause he like for him like how much he like puts into like the website that uh, EMF has and stuff. He does an awesome job with like talking to the riders and stuff. And that's like checkers in him. I love checkers. Like I know him in real life, but I but everybody does a great job within the game of hosting. But yeah. here we go with the 450 main. And Let's it's actually uh, Nayubi yeah. running the actual website. Maxim is more like the most active admin as a moderator. So, All right. just to clarify. I think Tyson got the. Nope, that's a. Ooh, Veltri that? Tynum getting the whole shot in front the of Smash Zero. Really far up as well. Wearing a hoodie in the race. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Badass. But Veltri Tynum actually. Oh, they believe. got Tyson right there already, too. In the, nope. Oh, pass him for second. Uh, yeah. Clean pass. Oh, oh Hunter Root is buried. Maxime's in fourth, I think? Yeah, that's really good. Hunter is buried. Oh! 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 So, a lot of people no. going down. Tyson, yeah. Lacoste, Monsieur. And Tyson is actually up to lead in front of Valtteri. Wow, yeah, that's fast. Uh, the OG Fartknocker, sorry for the Vulcan pack being so big. I'll make it small in the update. And actually, I don't mind really if a pack is one gigabyte in download. I mind. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Same. Yeah. Like a, it it uh, would take me a week to download. That's I'm, like Flowtech, you know? Flowtech's pack was huge. I think I downloaded a pack for Rush Chapman and one more guy. And it was one gigabyte. And at the end of the night, I did not see either of them. Well, no, that's like Rush's, uh, their military stuff this week was 100 megs for three riders. I was like, what? Yeah, it's insane. That's because their regular bikes are 4K and Carlo didn't know how to resize them and just, he said he updated them, but he didn't. And about, as me, I have 100 megabit down and live in Sweden, so I can download a gigabyte what? in a few Guys, minutes. I have 2.3 down. <laughs> I have, whenever I'm on my regular internet, I have like 8 down and 3 up, but whenever I turn <laughs> to my Verizon, whenever I turn to my Verizon hotspot for racing, I have like... 16 down and 8 up, I think. Wow. That, that's amazing. I, mean, I have yeah. 2.3 down and 0. 0.1 up. What do you want? <laughs> but you actually pay... It takes me 6 hours to upload a 380 megabyte video to YouTube. And you oh pay God. so much for your internet, too. It's I do. Insane. It's insane. Well, it's that's like monopoly. me. Like me. I have to pay for, well, my parents pay for the regular internet that we have, but I have to pay so I can race these races because my ping will shoot up high if I don't. Yeah. And that's 130 bucks a month for wow. the phone for, tw for 20 yeah for 20 gigs for my hotspot a month. Yeah, I wow. mean I pay. That's a hotspot though. That's kind of different. I pay 20 bucks a month for my speed. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna move to Sweden. <laughs> yeah, I <think> so. <laughs> and right. I'm, I'm, I'm keep complaining that I have I went from having 100 up, 100 down to hey, just... uh, 25 up and uh, 8 down. And I was like, oh, this internet sucks, man. <laughs> well, Root just made the pass to fourth, and then my buddy, uh, Robert Wilson, we also call him Monty, he's in fifth right now. Oh, that's good. So Hunter Root's actually making passes, and Hunter Root seems to be about 25 seconds roughly off of the lead. How far do you think he'll get to Tyson? I don't know. With that speed, know. he ran in the heat race with 57s. I don't know. He just need to, it's getting a lot. The time is running away, I think, because Tyson is—he he knows what he needs to do. They're both super consistent. Yeah, yeah. and Tyson knows that. Yeah, if he want to beat Root, he must and just like keep plugging away. And Valtteri Tian and actually just hanging on to him now in second. And Dennis Fjellberg, 21st place. 
Well, that's something that, about Val Perry I noticed too. He seems more of like an outdoor rider like I am whenever I've watched him. Yeah. He's so yeah, he's fast super, and consistent yeah. outdoors. It's yeah, ridiculous. Yeah, he's super fast, yeah. Because that's like the Italian championship. We had a pretty good battle at like the second round, I believe it was. Yeah. I mean, it's amazing. Dennis Fjellberg, 19th place. Not where he wants to be. Yeah, Fjellberg actually, is probably just in the wrong state of mood now, after all these races. Yeah. Uh, they're starting to spread open a little bit now, but the battle for fourth was pretty good between Smith and uh, Wilson there for a second. Yeah. And Root not far behind either. Oh, so Root must have went down. Yeah. Oh, and Jason Soul went down in third. Man. It was like a five-way battle for third now. Oh, Val Perry's right on Tyson right now. And oh, Ryder's down. Oh. Ah, oh, Val Perry. Val Perry coming out with a short straw off the stick. Well, actually. No, that's not how you say it. Wasn't that bad. Just lost about a second. Yeah. Tyson must have made a mistake because he only ran a 103 that lap. Yeah, there's a lot of. I would be happy right if I now. ran a 103 in race. Because Val Perry made that small mistake and still got a 101. Yeah. They like qualified. It's basically a 101 flat. So I had that's one lapper. I just one more lap now for Valtteri before we got Tyson up there again. Like a Ooh. never ending stream of lappers. <laughs> It looks like Is that tight. Yeah, that that's what we call closed course racing. Yeah, yeah. that's Maxim Tyson getting lapped. Oh, oh, down. No. Swapped. Yeah. oh did you see Fjellberg? Seconds over third place. Did you see Fjellberg uh, taking out somebody? That was uh -uh. rough. And Fjellberg's already been docked a few positions for aggressive riding this year. But that's like him for RF. I I'm. What I was told from by somebody was that he was a little upset that he couldn't race 250s oh, anymore because of the new rule. So, yeah. Friskus is actually down in the lead now. I mean, he's been around for so long, so he should be in, should move up to the 450s. Not to mention he won championships. And yeah, because RF made the new rule of where if you uh, went two seasons with over 300 points, you have to race the 450 class. Oh, I only I saw that people were talking was talking about the new rule, but I actually never read what it was. So that makes sense, Don. Well, it just gives more room for people that are like Connor Linz who are just coming up. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, it's sort of in real life. It's like seeing these guys that are over 25 years old just running 250, 250, 250, 50. To me, it's like. 250 should be for the younger newcomers. Like Tyler Rattray when he was over. Yeah. Don't you still ride 250? <laughs> <laughs> but he's amateurs, that doesn't count. I mean, oh, my yeah, racing sorry. career started this year for sure. <laughs> okay. So, <laughs> Val Terry is only one second down yeah. from Tyson. Looking at Andrew Santos, he's probably caught a ghost that rider. Considering how that played out, missed it. Hunter Root finally up in third now, but <laughs> he's got 27 seconds up to Valtteri. So, do we have any exciting battles on the track? Not right now. Fjellberg up. I mean, Valtteri's about a second behind Tyson. Yeah, it's probably close. for the lead. <laughs> I'd go on board with Valtteri. I think that'd be yeah. sweet. Yeah, on board at the moment. And then Fjellberg actually. Closing up on the top 10 here. Oh, that lapper. Oh, almost taking down Valtteri. The number f 338 of Jason Soul down in 11th place. So these guys seemingly have already lapped Dennis Fjellberg. Really? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's strong. And 
Tyson's also your. Uh, he's got the. Oh! Oh! Oh, and he clipped. Did he clip the. Yeah, he, his pole? head just killed himself. Oh, it was wow. over. Those the poles. camera made that so much more intense. Oh my god. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I was focused on the lapras. I didn't see him going down. So that gave Valparius uh, around a set, close to 7 second lead. And I fall is usually between 7 and 10 seconds, so that that's probably about right. And Valtteri down, so Tyson is actually going to retake the lead. And who's uh, gaining from all this? Hunter Root in Ooh. third place. Uh, I still like He's, Well, I don't think uh, it, it's... No, it's uh, probably not up there. Oh, lappers. But it's just pretty far away. Yeah, it's still 25 seconds. Oh, it's 17 now. Oh, oh yeah. Where's Dennis? Yeah. 17, but he's, like, gained 10 seconds on them since he got up to his third in two laps ago, so... And he's actually ran the fastest lap now, the 58-4. Yeah, that's insane. Uh, and Valtteri oh. made a mistake. Yeah. So, Hunter Woods uh, sort of reminded me of Cooper Webb. Bad start, but so fast and consistent. It looks like Dennis is trying to catch on to Tyson here to make oh, get some free passes. And yeah, Dennis just oh, later. dying in the whoops. Nice triple quad from Tyson. Ooh, Hunter almost hit that lapper. Oh yeah, so Hunter is 15 seconds now. It's just inching his way and it's still half the race to go. Well, now to be I don't know what's sure. the, with the timing. Actually, it just keeps flipping from 15 to 10 seconds, and uh, the timing is a little bit off if you're watching the live stream uh, or like live timing. I don't know what's yeah. up with it, but it's it's some sort of bug or something that it can flick like from zero to 15 seconds. Yeah. Nice grub from Tyson. God. Honor. Woo. Now them hitting that triple quad consistently is crazy. I nobody. Yeah, nobody's pulling off the quad quad uh, after the oh, finish right line. Oh, right here. Yeah. I, I did see Dennis do it. Yeah, Dennis did, it, did. Yeah, in the heat race and the LCQ. I saw one more rider hit it, but I can't remember who it was. Seems like Jonathan Olson has rage quit. <laughs> Just being five laps completed. Uh, he was fifth in the championship as well. Yeah, I mean, that's too bad. He's had such a great season going, so. Yeah. Too bad he decided to rage quit. But if the case would be that he's running his old controller from uh, that he ran last Nationals, he's having disconnection issues. Oh. But he told me they purchased a new one, so he shouldn't be any issues with that. Well, that's like me, some kid, uh, like me and Seaberg in our LCQ, we had the greatest start, you know, but kid behind us that his controller disconnected, I, I don't know. Yeah. Oh well. I don't know. Protest. No, not protest. I, I did this connection and just being pissed off. Yeah. Not getting the whole shot. The Valtteri is actually gaining a little bit on Tyson now. Yeah, look at that. 3.2 seconds. Ooh. Oh, Lapper. Well. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lapper! like watching the practice out in AMA. So oh, Root. Fjellberg up to 9th place. Currently working on Shirley Way for 8th. And Fjellberg just clipping that pole, man. Those poles are deadly, for sure. <laughs> a lot of victims from those poles tonight. Yeah. Yep. Almost like a pole dancing club. <laughs> That's like the one before the finish, whenever you go triple, triple, single, if you go too far for the sink inside, oh, you're done. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's gnarly for sure. If you go too, too far inside, you're going to have to grab those one. <laughs> Fjellberg actually down to 11th now. Lost a few positions from that pole dance. Valtteri went down, so now Hunter's caught up roughly 10 seconds. They've already lapped up the fifth. 
It's insane. Oh, yeah. And we're only on lap 13. Pretty much like the 250 down. Well, 14. I, I was looking at 5th. <laughs> and Root is just keep plugging 58s right now. Oh, he's caught up a lot. Yeah, look at that. Hunter Root just being a few seconds short of Valtteri tying on. Yeah, Valtteri went down, didn't he? I don't, I yep. don't know. So, so Valtteri so. is 12 seconds off Tyson now. With six laps to go. Now, who is second in the points of this series right now? Was it Hunter? Uh, Tyson uh, is actually second in points. Hunter is third. Oh, okay. So, and there's four points between Tyson and Hunter. So it looks like Tyson is going to be the new points leader. Oh, Valtteri, you clipped the pole. Oh, the pole. This is those poles. That gives Hunter second. Nice to see the lap over there. Though, Tyson's way too far in front. He's gonna have to gain like two and a half seconds a lap. Unless Tyson makes a mistake. I know that like a few team changes for this year. Barry Fly is no longer in the mix, I s it seems. Oh. Any information yep. since I'm so but bad with they teams? Went under. Oh. Because it was pretty much just Tyson and Hunter left, and they kept running old skins. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but the team owner was Barry or something, or I never got the yeah. story. Yeah. Uh, I guess Adam and Taylor just didn't play. Huh. And that's like Motosport, uh, that team doesn't exist no more. No? I mean, they um, half exist all the time, though. And then... Hunter MC actually Hunter hit the quad. Yeah. yeah. MCD Honda, with that Carlin was on and all them, that isn't around because I think Mason's leaving the community? Not sure. I was told? I mean, I'm so bad with people. I wish I was more caught up to, like, the... Famous it's a guys, lot of or information. well, it's bad for you because, like, whenever you're going to bed, everybody for us is like starting to get on. Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. usually watching Team Speak. Like, there's just some nights where I'm just going to bed like 4 a.m. because I've had so much to do, or just not being able to go to bed. I'm like, oh man, all the people that want to talk to on Team Speak are all now. Why can I? It's just so sucky. Yeah, also, it's not easy to keep up with all the. New teams, people switching teams and all that. Exactly. I mean, it changes from overnight, pretty much. Yeah, all the team hoppers too. <coughs> Siebel. <laughs> <laughs> kind of yeah. makes like me respect the people that actually stick with the team more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Valtteri Tainan I mean, is actually going to catch up to Hunter Root. I'm sorry to cut you off, but Hunter Root actually cased the quad, so Valtteri got the second place. Yeah, I think Hunter was just desperate for making up time on Tyson and started trying to quad that section. Yeah. yeah. And it actually looks like Tyson has the fastest lap of the race with a 57.8. That's, That's just crazy. nuts. Oh, and Valtteri but goes down. Yeah. A Fjellberg up to ninth place. That's what they were run down. Schmidt fourth. He makes a couple fifth. more mistakes. He could get lapped. Luciano sixth. Dana Carlson seventh. Then it's Fjellberg eighth. Robert Wilson ninth. Durham Mero tenth. Maxim Tyson. Shallow Wade. David Prevost. Old Skelman. Grantin Dubuis. Jason Saul. John Lacoste. Kevin Lelong. John Rodier. Kevin Atelier, Anton Everson, and Jonathan Olson not here anymore. Ooh. So two laps to go, pretty much. Yeah. And um, Valtteri is still seven seconds of Hunter. Well, Hunter's but... like in the mix of lappers really bad right now. <laughs> well, did you just send that lapper flying over the curb? I, <laughs> I believe so. <laughs> If you look at fifth place, we can see a battle between two teammates, uh, Andrew Sanders and Matt Misiron. Oh yeah. Oh. Andrew 
trying Ooh. to make the pass. <laughs> I don't think you could have been any closer right there. That mm -hmm. was so gnarly. I mean, there's a Don't few inches. But keep in mind, we have to talk to each other after the race. <laughs> well, probably. Being teammates of probably. They might oh, be in the same look at right now. Oh. Oh. oh, he went down. He was probably happy that he didn't take him out because I think it was a mistake on his part. Yeah, it didn't look. Was, it didn't look intentional. It was too far into the turn. Yeah, and it really looked like he. Try and did everything he could to actually avoid uh, running into him. I th I think he's like he tried to scrub more to the inside, but like his back end just kind of gave out a little bit, and it just pushed him way too far. Yeah, that's what it looked like at least. And again with the time zones, it's been like I've been catching Motagogo's streams the last few days, and it's been like when I'm waking up, he's probably much ending his streams. Well, you have heard yeah. now his streams that like he, four a.m. that he's. He said he's done with Sam now again. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yep. that's too bad. I mean, it makes sense. Some people are just really disrespectful. Yeah, you I know. mean, it seems like his stream, like the amateur thing, they just didn't get the appreciation as it deserved. I mean, stream for five hours, one event, that's not fun. Because I'll, I'll tell you, like, his uh, stream from... Uh what was it? Monster Cup this past year. I really enjoyed it. I felt like he did a good job streaming. Yeah, it was yeah. really good, and I yeah. really enjoyed the the off season thing as well. It's really good. The FM FAM MX. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it, I think the first stream he did this year was the Dead Meat Racing. That was like actually racing. Each yeah. race started 3 a.m. for me, so I got to bed around 7 a.m. Was... I just noticed his last lap, Tyson wins. <laughs> Hunter Roots <laughs> going to take second place probably. Valtrytanen just crashed. Yeah, a lapper in the way. Oh, lapper in front of Hunter Roots just jumping over him. So Hunter Roots taking second oh. place. Valtrytanen taking third. So they lapped. Tyler uh, Schmidt confirmed for Santos. fourth. Place oh, had yeah. been lapped. Yeah. So Santos beat out uh, Moiseron or the team battle. Man, he's another American that you usually don't see do uh, EMF. Been Ty doing it the past couple weeks. Tyler oh, Schmidt. I haven't seen him around. Yeah, I saw him last week. Yeah, he's been around for a few weeks. I think I saw him last year too. Because I know, like me and like Uzik, we're usually like the main Americans that always show up. Well, and Chromie, he does Supercross. He doesn't really like outdoors. So. Yeah. And we have. Chromie is the anti Donovan. <laughs> <laughs> True. Because, <laughs> no, look, I lapped him at Unadilla last year at RF. Oh, nice. <laughs> I... So we. But he, me and him are good friends. He's a funny guy. Well, thanks for having me, Storkin. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to come around a little bit more. If it's, Hopefully, I make my main event, so I'll put it that way, <laughs> and I'll be able to come. Yeah, if can... I don't, I'll be back. Yeah, for sure. Fun to have you here. Thank you. I'll talk to you in a little while. Yeah, see ya. See ya. Later. So see ya. Tyson taking a win in front of Hunter Root, Valtteri Tainan, Tyler Schmidt, Andrew Santos, Matthew Musiron, Danny Carlson, Dennis Fjellberg working his way up to 8th place, Dora Marot, and Charlie Way. So that's our top 10 rundown. Stay in racing. Now it's just a question, did I save the wrong demo here? Oh no. I have it either way, but I just want to see. No, that's 37 megabytes, that should be alright. So yeah, I think the live stream is going to be done for the night here. Um, happy for everybody to tune in. It's really fun. We keep going strong with about 25, 25 viewers the whole stream. That's really good. So thanks everybody for tuning in and thanks for co-commenting with me. No worries, that no, was fun. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Yeah, so, see you next week. Yep.